We're here today with Steve Ellery. Steve, how you going? I'm great, thank you. Unreal. So what we're going to talk about right now is upcoming for the Bathurst 6 Hour. We're doing a launch for your product. Uh, you've got your boys back with you. Yep. What are you up to this year for the Bathurst 6 Hour? Well, much the same as last year. Um, you know, Dalton and Tristan and myself are doing it again together. So the Ellery boys are going to have a, have a crack again. Um, and, you know, there's a little bit of unfinished business at the mountain for us. So um, last year was great. We were in the podium hunt all day and we had an issue with the car towards the end. So um, our goal this year is much the same, just try and put ourselves there and give ourselves a chance and um, hopefully have no problems with the car and finish it off this time. So walk through last year, family operation. Um, a, a lot of people have actually looked what you and your family have done and they've actually followed you. Hmm. I think it's great. I'm an elder gentleman as well. I'd love my kids to want to come and do racing with me. What's it like as a father watching your kids race with you? Yeah, it's funny. I said that many, many years ago. I made it clear that one day I'd love to do something like a, a Bathurst, I don't know, 12 hour, six hour, whatever with the kids, 1000 even, you know, back then when I was racing. So hmm. um, it's always been something I wanted to do. Hmm. And the kids grew up through karting. They've raced at the top level of karts their whole life. And when they got in the cars and then we, we moved into the production car with Berwick and the Linton team, um, you know, it just became obvious that the six hour was something that we were going to concentrate on. Mm. And it was a late decision for me. Only, only probably two months before the race last year, I decided, OK, let's give this a go. It's been a dream. Let's do it. So um, we went and did it. And it was exactly that. It was just a dream. It was great. It's, it's the best weekend I've ever had motor racing just to go there and do that with with my family and uh, can't wait to get back there this year and do it again. So clearly after that first practice session you got the bug back? Uh, I'd say the second I drove out of pit lane and I drove up Mountain Straight for the first time in what was it 13 or 14 years um, I actually got on the radio and I was quite quite boisterous. <laughs> um, the journey across the top of the mountain was very cool. Yeah, um, yeah missed, missed, missed the track, missed the place um, it's very special to me and, and, and also holds um, some very harsh memories for me too. Um, so look, I don't, I don't look at Bathurst like I have to go there and get redemption anymore. Um, I just look at Bathurst as a place that I love, it's a track that I love and I just can't wait to get back there and give it another go and go around there again and, and feel that, that excitement that I felt last year when I turned that first lap. Um, after the race, how did the body, you know, <laughs> did, did, did it bounce back as quick as what you'd like? It was actually pretty good. Um, the BM isn't, like it's a very, very nice car to drive, like Berwick and um, Ralph Bellamy and those guys, they've engineered um, a really, really nice car, a very nice car to drive. Um, the MRF tyres that we use are very difficult because um, of the grip level that it's got, so it's really the thing that keeps you on your toes around there. Mm -hmm. You've got to be very smooth. Um, but no, for an old guy out of the seat for a long time, I felt pretty good. Mm. I was a bit sore the next day and for a few days after it, but that's to be expected when you gave yourself two months after 13 or 14 years. Yeah. So look, you're back in the BMW product again, BMW M3. Yep. You're right, they are a very well balanced car and they're certainly the weapon of choice for the six hour. Yeah, well they've dominated the race, haven't they? And um, the boss, Berwick, has um, won the race before with Tim, so... We're in the best stable. They won it last year with SVG. Um, so look, all we've got to do is just go out there and, and, and drive. Everything else is done for us. We don't have to worry about that. And that's the beauty of it. That's, that's why it's so good. And we can go there and relax and have just such a good time and just concentrate on what we've got to do. Because um, we've just got such a professional outfit behind us. So personally, what's your preparation for this year? Um, well, my preparation's been a little bit scattered at the moment. I um, did my back just after Christmas, um, and I've had pretty much eight weeks where I haven't been able to do much at all. Um, I've had scans and found I've got bulge discs, um, so I'm managing that at the moment. Um, so I've got testing coming up in a few days, and um, that's going to really stress the back out, and we'll see how it comes after that. So unfortunately for me, my preparation's been very very short. I've got um, five weeks to get ready. Um, the back's feeling pretty good at the moment. So I go testing this week. Um, I'll see Friday, Saturday, Sunday where I'm sore and what I need to work on. And I've only got a few weeks to get that done. So mentally, I'm in a really good space. I, I, 
when I'm behind the wheel, I know what I've got to do. Um, whether I'm as fast as the the good guys or not's another thing. But um, I've got the I've got the skills and I've got the maturity and I've got the knowledge. And once I'm in the car, I know what I've got to do. I'm I'm confident with that. Uh, you got some partners for this year. Um, at this point in time, we're looking. So um, yeah, we need someone. Um, look, obviously, we've always got Chelgrave in our corner. Um, backing us, but we are after major sponsors and, and other sponsors like anyone really. Um, so we're in the process of working on our first one, which will be our clothing sponsor. Um, and after that, um, I hope that um, just prior to the six hour, we'll be able to announce something that's um, going to be exciting for that. Possibly even um, um, the Trans Am race coming up at Phillip Island in a few weeks. Beautiful. Thanks for chatting to us. We'll see you at the test day. No problem. Thank you.